A really important and fun fundraiser is on the calendar in support, of course, the work, the essential services by Oasis Women's Shelter in Owensboro. Andrea Robinson has been waiting here all day, <laughs> watching all the behind the scenes, and she is the executive director. Welcome to the show, Andrea. Thank you so much for having me. Well, it's going to be fun, Absolutely. but before we get into the fun, let's talk about the work of the, the shelter and the mission and who you serve. Okay. So Oasis has been around since 1981. It serves all seven counties in the Green River Area Development District. Um, we serve all survivors of intimate partner violence. Um, commonly, people think that we only serve women, but actually we serve all survivors. So of um, male survivors, teen, youth, dating violence, um, children, dependent children of victims of intimate partner violence. Um, I always like to make sure that I'm acknowledging the difference between domestic violence and intimate partner violence and what specifically we serve. Um, we may not have services available for someone like a mother and a child that is maybe experiencing domestic violence. So when we look at laws, domestic violence can go either way. Intimate partner violence doesn't, it's more um, a picture of that intimate relationship with a partner or even teen and dating violence, so. And how do people find you? We have a 24-hour crisis hotline. Um, we also are on Facebook, and so normally people call us. We'll get refer referrals from um, community agencies, the health department, doctor's offices, Owensboro Health. Um, it just depends um, on who their needs are. Sometimes we get referrals from people who have received our services or are aware of our services, and they may um, share that information with someone in need. The, and then their own lives. Mm -hmm. So all of that excellent service costs money. Uh, <laughs> so lots of money. Got to have some funding here. Yes. So trivia night, tell us about the idea behind it. It sounds like lots of fun. Yes, it is. So it is our annual fundraiser and it is absolutely amazing. Um, if you're smarter than a fifth grader, then you know, <laughs> it definitely fits. Um, but we have um, tickets available for $60 and so we also have tables of eight. So for $450, you can purchase a table. So it makes it a little cheaper per ticket. So a group of friends can get together. Um, but we have some pretty challenging uh, trivia, fun trivia. And we have a very guest, a special guest MC this well, year. Well, who might that be? Oh. None other than Ron Rhodes himself. Ron Rhodes. <laughs> well, he, you know, if it wasn't going to be lively, it will be now. Yes, you know, for he sure. was there with us last year as well and did an amazing job. So it, we, we're fun. grateful. Yeah. And where will you be and when will it be? It is um, this Friday at 5:30. Um, dinner is included. It's at the Green River Distillery, and um, yeah. So we'll have food there. Old Hickory um, will be providing food. Um, so we're really excited and we'll have an auction there as well. Um, so tickets are still available and we're also still accepting donations for auction items. Oh, great. T till the last minute? Yes. Really? Okay. Yeah. And are you doing the silent and or, uh, an no, open? No, it'll just... all be live. Right. Well, it's silent, but at the event. A at the event. Yes. Okay. Well, if you have any items to get there, get over there and uh, support the work that you do. Thank you, Andrea, for all the wonderful work you do in our community. Thank you so much. Don't miss Ron, by the way. We'll be back with more Lifestyles right after this.